Okay, so today what I'm going to share with you is a little bit on the human resource because I think last semester I didn't do this uh, and then it's quite chaos if, if I don't actually, uh, what do you call it? If I don't actually talk about, uh, okay, eh, cannot read, cannot read. Let me share my screen first. Okay. Okay, so we have 123. How to minimize this thing? Eh? Uh, I don't know. Lah. Hide floating meeting controls. Okay, hide. Okay, I want to hide. Okay. Now we hide. Okay, if you have any question, you can ask. Just interrupt me. Eh? You don't have to be shy in my class. <coughs> when you become alumni later on, you are going to meet me again because I'm actually the, the head of alumni for BBA. Hey, where is it? Okay, this one. So within the WhatsApp group, I share with you several things. Yeah. Uh, my name is not Azura Uma. I'm made of a I, I, I actually share an account with Dr. Azura. So you don't have to be afraid. <laughs> I'm not sure if you're afraid. Okay, so I I share with you three things inside the WhatsApp group. Number one is uh, human resource management, which I'm going to start after this. And then there is a peer evaluation, FAQ, and also the list for CRM, CB, and suppliers, eh, which I'm going to share with you later on. Okay, uh, this... Uh, Briefly, eh? okay, so just a brief. Uh, when I when I hide through that, do that's me. Should be there is some lag, and I don't know. Like, this is my first time using what we call it, um, using Zoom. Eh? Uh, where am I pull up the Okay, Tapula. <coughs> okay, if you have anything, you just interrupt me. Uh, if let's say there is a chat, please uh, please tell me because I, I don't know where is the where is the control thingy. Okay, so okay, human resource. So uh, this is not a, a typical human resource that you 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 learn from the human resource uh, HR class. Eh? This is not. This is your own human resource for entrepreneurship week. Uh, I do make a little bit a little bit of conclusion on your human resource. What is going on after after several semester teaching you guys? I do see some sort of a pattern lah. Uh, what is going on among the groups? Eh? So, if you see the, the slide that I give you, okay, it's about uh, for Entrap Week only. This is for HMA resource for Entrap Week. All right. I'm going to talk about Canva after this. Eh? So, that one after this. Okay, so the first one is talking about distributing tasks. Okay. I give uh, this this semester have six uh, six members in it, so each of your members have their their own position. Eh? So one will be CEO. You need to you need to elect one one of you becoming CEO. Okay, CEO is the team leader lah. Okay, the team leader like usual every single semester will will be given extra one marks. Eh? Extra one mark for Cam from me because they will be dealing with me a lot. I, I'm actually going to open up a one WhatsApp group for them. And they are the ones who actually need to remind their team members. So I'm not going to talk to the members of all, 100 something members. I'm going just to talk about, uh, I'm, I'm only going to remind basically more on uh, with regards to group things, group, uh, group work to the team leader. The team leader will remind uh, the members. So please choose your team leader uh, effectively. Okay. 
So one will be team leader or CEO. So if you have a team leader that have a business, so they should be the one who actually become a team leader. Team leader is not just like doing nothing. Eh? Uh, there will be a lot of things that team leader need to do. Marketing or sales, uh, operation, administration, financial, and HR. So um, this is all the tasks that roughly I get from your seniors, okay, what they are doing about the positions that they have. But it's not compulsory to follow these guidelines. Eh? Uh, I just give you a little bit overview so that you can see lah, uh, how to delegate your tasks effectively, balance in terms of balance. Eh? And I know that it's not easy to get a balance, a balance, uh, what do you call it? A balanced task, a balanced scope, a balanced capital, a balanced profit. It's very hard to get that, but uh, I will show you how you can actually give and take in, in, in certain way, okay? All right, so <clears throat> type of task, you must understand that we have desk tasks for the group. Desk tasks mean whatever you do with your laptop, okay? You just sit around in, uh, in one place, you do prepare documentation. Uh, the, the, the Excel that I give you is part of the documentation. You strategize, you scheduling. Uh, this is this task. Uh, you advertisement design from Canva. You update social media, or maybe you open up a Shopee or maybe Facebook marketplace. Uh, or this is called as an e-commerce handling uh, platform if you open one. If you don't open one, it's okay. Uh, so this is all the desk stuff. For example, uh, some, some, some of your seniors did, uh, you call it uh, the business plan been handled by totally a different person. Uh, or you call it uh, from, from those who are actually doing a practical task. Okay, practical task is something that task been given to the members who actually go to the field, okay, uh, meet suppliers, the one who actually post the product or maybe so do some sort of service uh, or maybe meet the customer or do the packaging. So the, all these practical tasks, also another task. So uh, you must, you if you want to delegate, uh, delegate, what you call it, delegate tasks, uh, this is the task that you need to focus on lah, okay? I don't know if it's because a, every business have different different way of doing business, okay? So when delegating tasks, consideration should be given to uh, the credit hour being taken by each member per semester, uh, family commitment, sometimes uh, some of you helping your parents or maybe taking care of your, of your, what you call it, of your siblings and all, okay? Or maybe some of you have kids already. So this kind of thing you need to, to ask your members, eh? okay? A weekly schedule uh, for each member, uh, even during the weekend, you must set a schedule. Uh, within your 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 group as well. Living location, is it rural? Is it urban? Is it hard to get supplier? Is it near to, to the supplier that you want? Uh, is it very far away from the supplier or maybe far away from uh, the postage center and whatever, okay? So internet connectivity is very important as well. You need to ask your, uh, your siblings, as, uh, your siblings lah. Your members, eh? your members. Capital inclusion, okay, this one, not necessary for you to have, for each member to be given same capital, meaning that uh, maybe some of you give 50 ringgit, maybe some of you give 10, 100, maybe some of you give 80, per, uh, 80 ringgit. So this kind of capital inclusion uh, can be uh, not balanced, but it, it will be balanced to the, to the task being given to them. For example, the, uh, this, this person do not give an, uh, a lot of capital, but this person do a lot of practical tasks. For example, they, they go for meet suppliers, okay? Uh, meet customers, posting, packaging. Uh, as for me, this one is the 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 difficult one lah because it, it requires your energy and time. And the hardship of the task, for example, um, expertise. Okay, some people do not know how to use Canva. Eh? 
but I do encourage, I do uh, ask you to try to to learn how to use Canva. Eh? Canva, I'm going to teach you maybe in next week or so, eh? because uh, next week, next class, I'm going to teach you how to find a supplier. Okay. Okay, so these are uh, the things that I come up with. We have the team leader. Uh, the team leader must manage the group members, give instruction, reminder to make group members, uh, receive my instruction, eh? uh, share instruction. Uh, you, you must have a team leader that is very effective. Eh? If let's say your team leader is sleeping, uh, your, your, your group is doomed, eh? you can change team leader. Uh, in the middle of semester, whenever you want to change, okay. Uh, make decision for the company, set business goals, uh, balance job scope between all members, help the other group members in overall tasks, okay. So team leader basically must uh, must uh, must be the one who actually push the members to do their job, okay. Okay, human resource uh, basically is the person who hire additional employees or maybe some agents, if let's say you are the one who actually the supplier. Okay, if you want to hire extra employees for your group also okay. Okay, for example, the practical practical task here, you want, you don't want, you don't want to handle, you just hire someone else, can also. Okay, you just manage, uh, for example, a service or uh, whatever. Eh? Uh, so there, there is a there, there was a, a senior of yours actually do that. They don't do the practical task at all. They just manage. Okay. Uh, resolve any conflict. If there is any conflict, uh, this is the person you go to. Okay, to come up with a good, uh, I don't know, good suggestion. Don't become the uh, the one who actually make the conflict become more uh, chaos. Eh? Okay. Make sure the team flows is effective. A prepare agreement. Uh, this is not compulsory, but I do advise for you to come up with an agreement of what? For example, uh, a capital. How much per, per person come up with a capital? Okay, so, but you must understand as well, not all your members have money. Eh? Uh, so that kind of thing also, you must actually take in into into consideration as well. For example, if let's say your group member, group member A, group member number one come up with uh, 30, 30 ringgit. Group number two come up with 30 ringgit. Three come up with 40, 40 ringgit, for example. Eh? So you can actually give back to the profit, overall profit, for example, this is 30%. Of the overall profit, uh, you can do like this as well. Eh? Uh, but this one applicable if you have balance with us. Okay, for example, this is thirty percent. Uh, do interrupt me, eh? because you are going to to um, to face this later on when you are doing your interrupt week. Okay, so for example, for the it can be like this, or maybe it's all thirty percent or thirty percent. 35, 35. For example, balance, eh? 100% divided by 3. Huh? I feel it, man. Huh? Uh, 33 lah, 33. So it's balance lah, 33. I all get 33.3%. Uh, but, but this person, uh, this two person get more practical tasks. Uh, this one only do tests can be like that as well. Uh, this one also practical. Uh, so this is the agreement between you guys. Okay. And HR, people, HR person also need to do this. All right. <coughs> uh, I need to figure out like, where is it? Where is the thing? Uh, I don't know lah anymore. Okay. <coughs> so that's how it is. Okay. Uh, administration manager handle customer order. So basically documentation wise, uh, compensation benefit. Okay. This one 
if you are doing a service, I don't know like if you I I I think it's service for this semester is very hard. Eh? Online online semester is very hard to do a service unless if you do on uh if you are actually together within a, the same location, you can do service. But if you are living somewhere here and there, so it's not really applicable lah, to do a service. Okay, uh, so basically this one is for service. Eh? Uh, the situation is like this. Uh, you are doing a service of, uh, what we call it? Apa ni? Let's see, nak dulu. Henna. Do you know Henna? You know it, Henna? Yes, ma'am. Uh, henna. Eh? So they are doing service of Henna. So one person can get up to, for example, three to five customer. So the other member doesn't get that much. For example, two only, and the other member get only one per week, or the other member get until 10. So the profit, if you want to divide equally, is not fair. So what you need to do is, you give the every single customer compensation. Uh, compensation, eh? for example, per person. For example, eh? this is the situation of the henna. Too. Per person get RM uh, 5 ringgit per customer. Eh? Okay. Uh, basic, for example, they get around one, uh, 100 customer. So it's their profit is around 500. Eh? Uh, so this profit minus the compensation, uh, minus the compensation, this one, then uh, the the balance of the profit, then we divide equally. We pay the uh, you pay your 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 friends your compensation first, then the profit after that equally. So this is the the the, the situation happen when you are doing service. Okay, uh, manages all legal matters for the company, supplier, agent. For example, if the supplier wants receipt or maybe invoice, uh, you are the one who actually need to come up with your invoice. Uh, this one is not compulsory. Sometimes they are the one who actually do the postage. Uh, this is practical one. Uh, helps other members. So basically, I put every single, uh, every single, what you call it? Every single position help other group member, help other group member because this is a teamwork. Eh? Marketing manager basically on social media, build brand awareness, uh, update the product and service in the social media, develop it, basically designing uh, advertisement in the Canva, uh, research target market industry. And inshallah, next week I'm going to teach you how to do the market research first. But what, what you are going to sell actually for Raya, Ramadan, what is uh, that kind of thing. Eh? So maintaining social media inside, uh, help the other group member, okay? Okay, operation manager is quite the practical task one lah. I mean, in terms of uh, the one who deal with the suppliers, the one who deal sometimes with the with the with the control of the inventories. Uh, this is not compulsory. You can actually depends on yourself if you feel that uh, you, you feel that no need to follow all this position make it very balanced or, or for all but it's okay lah, eh? as long as you are working as a team as a team it's enough for me so it's the operation develop timetable for production okay all right financial manager basically uh, calculate the cost for one product figure out the reasonable price to put on each product, uh, update the business account. Uh, the financial manager don't do last minute work, eh? meaning that at the end of the day, then you you, you, you report. No, uh, financial manager must actually report every week of the interact week. Eh? How many you get, uh, for example, you get um, more, more cost than profit. Eh? The, the, the cost that you have is actually more than your profit. So you need to report to your uh, to your team members that we are actually incurring, incurring too much cost so that you can actually strategize again. Uh, so don't, don't stick with one particular strategy only. Eh? Uh, 
give ideas, projection based weekly performance, monitor cash flow, managing and budgeting, financial forecast, so prepare activity reports. And of course, at the, at the end of the day, you are going to report in the financial statement. Okay, so basically my students. Uh, Madam? They, Madam? Yes. Oh, for financial report, for financial statement, is the mm -hmm. financial manager who is in charge to make financial statement or someone who is uh, 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 in charge of uh, accounting, accounting report? Uh, okay, uh, financial manager, when you are doing a, when what you are doing is actually you, you will, uh, you will work with together with the operation, like the one who actually do the practical task. Okay, you are the one who actually uh, putting all the data. Let me put, eh? let me open this one first. Okay, so you can see here. Okay, this is cash book. Uh, financial management uh, financial manager must start with this okay so the 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 first uh, the first sales you put it in here you can do whatever cash book you want as long as every single transaction for your company you put it in this excel so this is just a, a simple one lah okay uh, you can put the date the amount okay and then is it expenses or income Okay, if, 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 you, if you get capital, you want to make it a bit detail, you put capital lah, if you want. Eh? Okay, type of expenses, for example, uh, uh, raw material. Eh? Uh, raw material. So, the balance is around this one. Uh, basically, people start with capital first lah. Okay, people start with capital first. Okay, for example, balance, uh, you get capital from all your group members, for example, like 500. 600 eh? for example uh, notes uh, notes it's like a detail or something if you want for example uh, 100 per member okay all right so from here even though that you then you you for example this is expenses uh, you buy expenses around amounting for example uh, after you get capital then you expand you you spend for about 100 to buy raw material so 600 this one this one five hundred so this is a balance so from this cash book alone you can actually monitor lah how much capital you have left Suddenly, if you if you just let it go, this one, uh, you, you just do last minute job, man. You cannot see until at the end of the day, it's minus one hundred. Eh? Uh, so we we don't want this, lah. You are doing a very hard work. We don't want your capital, uh, your your profit become negative, lah, okay? Because when I see your seniors, some of some of them get what, a minus something. It's very 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 sad lah because uh, some of your seniors get i think the last last semester the the the, the maximum that they get is around 1800 eh they can get profit up to 1800 for one month uh, there's uh, also mm. yes ah uh, yes uh, madam i have my, uh, i have my own business and i have already that uh, I have the com the company, mm -hmm. so it's fine if I will use this information. Yes. From my uh, company. Yes, you can, but uh, try to make it as simple as possible, lah, for that one month only. Ah, uh, can uh? Okay, thank you, madam. Ah, uh, okay. So it's it's good to follow someone who have already have a business, eh? So you can actually the 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 rest of the members can actually. Uh, help you on selling or whatsoever. I think in in the last uh, semester there is also one one group. Uh, uh, one the team leader actually selling scarf. Eh? so she already have a business. You already have a 
have an Instagram that have around one one thousand something followers. So that 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 group actually get one thousand eight hundred, the 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 highest. But uh, basically, she said to me that basically her business get around around that profit lah, one thousand eight hundred. So. They are they are group members actually the the agents become the agents for the for her uh, for her business uh, so you can you can actually ask your uh, what you call it uh, your members to do that as well lah okay uh, it's up to you so that's why I say no need to follow my uh, my my task eh uh, this task basically applicable for for those who just want to open a business uh, so uh, this is the task lah for those who actually have a business uh, please share with me some of your experience can uh, because also I, I my business is actually different eh? uh, I'm, I'm i'm more actually on, on content developing i don't actually do some sort of product so okay <clears throat> so when it comes to my students they have two goals high cam high carry mark high profit okay uh some of groups get both of this, some of group get only high cam, carry mark, and some of group get only high profit but low cam. I don't know how they do it, but uh, that's how it is. So last semester get 76% of my students from my entrepreneurship class get A and A minus. Okay, it's a very good, excellent uh, performance. But uh, the highest, from my class in the last last I think last two semesters get 80 percent uh, so uh, in my class it's not about intelligent it's not about intellectual it's not about uh, how much you know about entrepreneurship it's about hard work uh, that's it eh? so do you 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 work together you ease each other members tasks and you do justice inshallah you will get that a not a minus a 80 something uh, okay, with me, uh, because I am actually appreciate on effort. Okay, this is founders agreement, uh, the agreement that I already mentioned in the, I don't know, human human resource. Eh? Uh, okay, this is this is called uh, founders agreement. Eh? Split of equity. So you need to come up with, for example, if you want to come up with a agreement, you can come up with an agreement. If you don't want to come up with an agreement, it's okay. But if you want to come up with a proper agreement, uh, this is how you come up with your agreement. Lah. Uh, for example, nature of prospective business, uh, what kind of uh, industry that you go in, for example, food and beverage, time period of business operation, for example, 5th April until... 30 April, uh, I think last semester, half of the groups uh, actually uh, do their business until at the end of the semester, they open up to three months. Okay, identity and proposed position, uh, who's, who's who, who's actually the manager of financial administration, okay, their job tasks, uh, the capital that they put every single person, uh, how much the ownership share, for example, how many, how many percent of uh, profit that they will get per member, okay, uh, and then uh, this one compensated if there is a compensation and also provision of this solving disputes for example if let's say one person is being in silent uh, you for example you want to put a, a legal term there if one member in silent the peer evaluation given to this member will be zero uh, uh, which is i'm going to talk about peer evaluation after this Okay, take over or closing the company. Okay, for I already told you that if let's say you have a, a, for local, if you have a local student in your in your group, you must register SSM. Okay, uh, I'm going to give you a video later on on how to open the SSM. Eh? It's all. It's all free for local students. I'm not jeopardizing international eh? because if you, uh, there is no problem for international to register SSM, okay? It's just that it will um, disturb your visa, your student visa, okay? So that's, that's why I say for a group that have all international students, you are not 
compulsory to open SSM. SSM, there is a scheme called One Student, One Business. It's actually a scheme for uh, student only. Uh, it's actually a scheme uh, that is free of charge for local students. And also uh, the data that you give to them will not be inside the LHDN. Eh? LHDN is tax. So you will not be in take account to the tax of Malaysia. So for example, we, you want to open the business only one semester. After that, you want to close, uh, you go back to the SSM website and you close it. You can do that as well. Okay, so take over closing the company is very important as well. For example, I would suggest only, uh, only one person register within the SSM. SSM can actually goes up to I think five students uh, per group per business, but I would suggest only one person that will take over the company because it's very hard lah, because uh, if you want to do the business, give to someone that is really want to open the business and take over the business. Okay, rather than you, uh, if they say there's no one want to take over, just give to anyone lah, but after after the semester is over, then you close it. Lah, eh? uh, don't make it uh, many names eh, within a business unless if you are very if you are siblings or maybe eh, you are real siblings or maybe you are best friend who actually do business together and then you want to come up with your own company with the with the, with the partner you, you have that uh, seriousness to that extent that you can do lah, uh, put several names but if not just put one name only all right Okay, to avoid conflicts, make sure that the job scope is balanced, capital equal, profit equal. This is one situation. Uh, nobody will, 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 uh, will, met, will get met. And number two, job scope is not balanced, capital not equal, profit equal. Uh, this one, uh, some people give uh, more capital than the others, profit equal. Uh, because some some people maybe give a little bit of capital, they get a lot of job scope. Uh, so that's how you balance your situation. Job scope not balanced, capital equal, profit equal. Uh, this one will will make uh, a, a conflict as well. Okay, this one will give co conflict sometimes. Okay, uh, job scope balance, capital. Uh, this one com commission per base. Okay, uh, for example, there are also sleeping partner. Eh? There's one person, uh, I think there's one, one, one student of mine, the, his group actually, I don't know, like, I think maybe the team leader is very rich, so all the capital he gave, he gave, I think 1000. So he's being a sleep, sleeping partner for the, for the group. Uh, I don't know, like that kind of thing. It's up to you guys. Uh, okay? <laughs> all right, peer observation. I go to peer observation. Eh? This is a very important thing with regards to your peer evaluation. It's not like 5% peer evaluation, no. This peer evaluation will, will disturb all your group, all your group marks. Let's go away. Eh? Peer evaluation is a performance survey on Google Form. Okay, uh, The survey is made for, for you for the entrepreneurship students. Okay, the purpose of this PE is to assess performance each individual. This is like your KPI, lah, your key performance index. Okay, everyone must submit their peer evaluation at the end of the semester. Okay, and uh, when the submission basically on uh, the end of the semester, the link will be given to you. Okay, I'll show you one of my Call it okay. uh, example eh, of peer evaluation from the semester. If you know them, just ignore the lie. <coughs> this is a very, this is also a very headache to me, but uh, as, uh, uh, as justice, I need to do this. Okay, uh, okay, this one eh, I take. Puding garu lah. Puding garu is quite okay. Okay. 
So every group have their own peer evaluation in Google Form. So as you can see, okay, huh, it's very detailed. All right. Okay, there are several sections. Uh, this one is more of a graphic. Uh, last semester, uh, this semester we don't have infographic. Okay, so every single assignment inside the group assignment, I will do section by section. BMC. Uh, we have willingness. Uh, this is your name. Eh? Uh, so this is your name. So this one is Instagram account. Group presentation video. Uh, this one we don't have video. Eh, this semester. Uh, Lucky for you, lah. And then we have business plan. Okay. And then this is how they respond. Okay, as you can see, they give each other five, 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 five until the end. So meaning, ah, uh, there is one, one person, not get five. So when all give five, you will receive 100% of your given, um, given what you call it, uh, group marks. If it's not 100%, for example, one, one person, uh, your, your other member give you four, uh, your, your, for example, your group, Group, uh, let me see, where's the four one? One and five, sorry. Okay. Okay, this one, eh? Uh, for example, uh, Mahi get one person give, uh, I don't know, he, her, her, she, uh, give her four. So uh, her business plan report marks for the group will not get 100%. Okay, let me show you one. So that's why this is the most dangerous thing eh? when it comes to. Okay, let me show you this one. <clears throat> so the detail cam I will put in Itaklim. Uh, inside the portal, I will not put like this lah because it's very, very detailed. Okay. Uh, as a, as a coordinator myself, uh, very headache as well, okay? As you can see here, this is original group marks. Okay. This is original group marks. Uh, we put only metric card and don't have to care lah, about your friends and eh, your, your group member. Okay, uh, so this is original group marks that they get. Oh, kat situ pun ya, Allah. All right. <laughs> And then, uh, as you can see, this is marks after evaluation. Eh? Let me let me compare the three point nine. Uh, this person get three point four. Okay, meaning that the other group member give marks not five. You understand? Understand? Eh? Yeah. Okay. So do your best lah, okay. Uh, treat this semester like your internship, just small internship, uh, okay? but you are doing your own, okay. Mana tadi? Sekejap. Hide video panel, ni ke? Hide floating, uh, control, out, shift H, Allah panjang. Okay. <coughs> so the detail kan will be like this. Uh, because this semester I increase the individual marks, uh, so inshallah there will be a little bit of risk of getting failed this semester. I don't like to see my my student fail eh, because of your their peer evaluation. Okay, so you don't have to like, for example, if let's say all of your members doing their own job, for example, one person do Instagram, one person do the operation practical task, one person do documentation. So what you need to do before you do the peer evaluation, you make a discussion with your group members and say that we just give all five marks because we all do our job, okay? You don't have to go one by one thinking about, for example, Mariam, did, did she do the infographic? Did she do the group presentation? Uh, no need lah. If let's say you are working as a team with regards to any kind of uh, task given to you, so you just... Uh, you just mark your your group members all five lah. Yeah. 
unless if your group members really doesn't give commitment, then you give them what they deserve. Lah. Okay. Uh, this is very, very important. Uh, this is a group that I show you that is quite excellent in their marking, uh, but there are other the groups that is not good. I don't want to show. Lah. Eh? I don't want to show. Okay. Okay, uh, next is Excel. Okay. All right, Excel, customer relationship management. For example, those who actually deal with the customer uh, should give their information to the to the one who actually do the documentation. Lah. Okay, for example, the, the customer name, the product service sold, amount and transaction, email and all. Okay, address. Okay, inshallah, last semester, uh, last semester actually I already did this. Inshallah, I will give you a data pool, eh? data pool. Uh, please remind me, if you need data pool from me, from last semester, from your seniors, uh, you ask me lah, eh? I will give you data pool. This is quite privacy, but this data is actually to help your future junior as well. And your seniors data will be given to you later on. So that you can actually, maybe you can give some uh, something to them those who actually bought from Entrack Week, meaning they are the customer of Entrack Week. So it's actually easy to give marketing to them. Eh? The cash book and suppliers, uh, put your suppliers as well, the name, their product type, what is the product service detail, for example, product type, uh, food, eh? uh, product or service detail. Uh, for example, you buy from them bun or something, or you go for uh, retail, for example, giant, uh, you put like that. Do you don't have to to I call it to fit in every single thing? For example, address you don't have. Uh, you just get phone number. You just put up phone number only lah. If you if you get phone number and their email, you get you put two of them. But if you only get their phone number, you just put phone number. Phone number is the what you call it is the the the, the valuable one. Eh? It's the valuable one. Okay. Any any questions so far? I speak non-stop. Eh? You should see that I cannot stop when I'm talking. All right. Everything okay? Eh? Okay. Inshallah, next uh, next class, I'm going to teach you on how to uh, to use a little bit on the Facebook marketplace. Eh? Uh, Shopee, I'm not really expert. Um, but basically, um, Instagram, I, I'm quite... Okay, love with Instagram. Okay. All right. Ma'am. Hmm. I have a question. What is it? Uh, Ma'am, is it necessary for each and every member of the group to open an Instagram account and give a post regarding the business? I know you only you only open one one business account only. Uh, you only open one Instagram for your business. Uh, Ma'am, uh, what about the post which will be giving water products and everything? So it will be in that one account? Yes, will it will be in the in that one account. So uh, if you see that the group assignment that I give you, uh, there is a four Instagram post. It's actually you can use it that that post again. I I and my my team on the Entrack Week team, we're also using that for our Instagram post and also website. So you can use that post and you can do other posts as well to actually make your Instagram very, very nice. Lah. Okay, let me show you some Instagram from your seniors if you want to. Okay, if you don't know where to find your seniors Instagram, if you want, you want to know how they do it, uh, you can go to Entrack Week. Eh? Uh, you can go to Entrack Week. Is Entrack Week also been liked by, uh, by what you call, uh, by business around Gomba as well? Eh? They also need. You go to Entrack Week, okay. Okay, this is last semester Entrack Week. As you can see, you can uh, go to them and see what what they are selling actually. So last semester is not really. Uh, it's not really much now when it comes to sales. Eh? So basically they are selling hand sanitizer, masks, eh? 
on all that okay uh, but i think uh, the one who actually give a lot of profit is food eh? uh, pizza get pizza they sell at dhaka only eh dhaka bangladesh uh, they get 1000 something as well for profit uh, this is the the successful one eh so hijab also 1000 something okay uh pudding garu also get quite a lot of profit uh, from food eh so i would uh if you want to come out if you don't know what to sell i if you are in the rium you can actually try to sell food because you are doing your business inside the campus and it's actually in ramadan month okay i would suggest not to cook yourself okay it will be very tiring and you have so many other other work to do okay okay so you can go uh, this is this is the the one okay you can go i i think this one get the, the highest one eh pudding garu highest instagram account so you can see how they do their design okay the design of the instagram also i'm going to teach how to design your your logo your instagram and uh, their instagram is very nice uh, see and they they choose a theme of colors as well they do a theme of colors and uh, this one uh, and what to put inside the how we call it uh, it's very nice lah that's why they get a lot of profit as well uh, instagram also is very important because this is the 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 the, the place that you are selling and yeah? your your customer come inside this one okay i'm going to 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 share with you how to tackle your instagram uh, soft sales hot sell and all that okay apa saya nak tunjuk saya lupa dah thank you ma'am all right okay um so have fun lah i think this semester is not really much like in terms of uh, uh, assignments eh because i cut several things uh, what you need to do is you focus on designing uh okay, there is no assessor this semester like the last semester we have successors eh coming and assess you okay Canva, uh, those who are not getting any links for me, please uh, PM me and give me your email. Eh? If you do not get my Canva link. Eh? Okay. Uh, why, is, why this is very important is because you can actually have premium account. I will not delete you. You can use it forever. Okay. You are still my students until the end of the, the day. Al-Qiyamah. Okay, my my account has been changed to education account because I'm a lecturer. So I put you as part of my students. So if you don't know how to change, uh, this is your Canva. Once you get my link, you click on the link in the email, and then it will uh, it will direct you to your Canva using the email that I give you. Okay, uh, that you give me. Sorry. Ah, uh, so uh, you go to here. As you can see, this is your personal. Eh? This is your personal. Uh, go there. Okay. All right. Saya nak benda lain, benda lain pula. Okay. You click here. You click on, I don't know what is this, the profile picture. Okay. Uh, as you can see, you have, you will have personal. You will have interact weeks. Okay. So this personal is your account that does not have premium, meaning there are some things will not be free. There are some things that is uh, cannot be open. So this is the one who actually have the premium account. When you click it on the entry week, okay, you click it on the entry week. Uh, so it will change. It will it will bring you into your class, and then your design all will be free. Okay, you can use every single thing. The, the elements in it. For example, you want to do Instagram. Uh, post 1080 uh, that's the size that i want you to do okay you have so much eh? uh, so many already uh, okay uh, so you just choose like choose whatever for example you want to do this choose this okay uh, who call me i have plus okay so <clears throat> uh 
Can you can you can you wait for a while? Eh? Wait for a while, eh? All right, sorry, sorry. Uh, someone sent me something. Okay, so as you can see here, we have a view. Uh, you can use now this one. Okay, the templates. Uh, basically, this template is not free, so you can use it now. Okay, so I'm going to teach you, inshallah, Canva uh, next week. Hopefully, I can cover lah, many things. All right. Okay, what what is what is what's more? So, oh, LinkedIn. I want to show you LinkedIn. I also share with you the LinkedIn already. If you lost with all this document, please go into Italim C. Yeah, I put everything in there. Okay, your LinkedIn. Your LinkedIn have a little bit different from your seniors. Okay. Number one is LinkedIn profile. Uh, you can start with now lah, but uh, of course, entrepreneurship review. You cannot start now. Okay. All right. So LinkedIn profile. Uh, this time around, I want you to fill in your LinkedIn profile. Okay. Uh, because I think because you are last last semester student, last year, final year, most of you. So. Okay. Um, so you will use this, and I need to endorse you something. Okay. So we go to LinkedIn. Um, madam. Hmm. Yes. About the LinkedIn um, individual assignment, mm. there's a part that um, it stated that we should name the um, we should write the name of our business. Should it be the same as the group um, business we are doing? Okay. Um, I would suggest if you come up with a brand, that is your company name, so you don't get confused. Eh? For example, you want to do, you want to sell a cake. Uh, Cheesecake Factory or something, uh, the company name. But if you have a different company name, so the company name that you put inside your experience is your company name, lah, not your brand name. Uh, some people have different company name, have different brand name. Yeah, basically like that. Lah. Uh, for example, uh, Unilever. Unilever have the several, several products and, uh, within it. For example, uh, Pantene, uh, that is brand. Uh, Rejoice, eh, shampoo, uh, that is brand. So if you have a brand for your product, don't put under experience. You put your company name. Okay. For example, you want to come up with the company name of uh, the combination of your of the team members' name. Can you suddenly come up with uh, Primus Company, Primus Enterprise. Basically, you will come up uh, when you register SSM, it will pop out enterprise lah because it's small. Primus, eh, the optimal price. Nah. Uh, Primus Enterprise. Okay, so you put here Primus Enterprise. Okay. Mana tadi? Okay. All right. So let's go. Okay, you understand eh? Yes, thank All right. you. All right. Okay, so use your full thank name. You. Ah, yes. Madam, sorry, uh, for the SSM registration, hmm. if our online so if our online business has already been registered in SSM, should, for example, I have an online business and I already registered with SSM, hmm. should our group make another registration under our group project or we can just use my registration ID? Uh, yes, you can use, just use whatever you already registered, lah, but you are not registered under one, one student, one scheme, too, can? Ah, uh, yes, we just done one student, one scheme. Ah, okay. Uh, so you just use the that one, lah. no need to. So you need to make another registration. Ah, uh, no need. Okay, okay just so use that one. Do. Okay. So whatever the company name that you come up with, uh, it's okay. Lah. It's just that the brand name is the most important one, uh, which I'm going to teach you also how to come up with a brand name that is going to reflect your products and eh? don't don't do a brand name that will not reflect your product for example uh, like your, your your seniors come up with pudding garu eh 
Uh, this is a brand name of uh, them. Okay, their, their, their brand name is Pondi Garo. Okay, uh, the, and, and they actually selling pudding. Okay, so that, that's how it is. Try to find a brand that actually can reflect your, your product. Okay, uh, if you ask me if you want to come up with several products, it's up to you lah. But I, I would suggest you just focus on one product only. Easier, you can make it easier lah for your, for yourself. Okay, so this one you can start now lah. Okay, uh, you don't have to, you don't have to wait until the end of the semester. Okay, uh, for inter interpretation review, I'm not going to cover. Eh, uh, I'm going to cover later on after you're done with your uh, internship week. Okay, so LinkedIn profile. What you need to do, you need to come up with your your full name, okay? Your full name, Fatih Husna Su'id, for example. Uh, if you don't want to put your full name until at the end of the semester, uh, after you done with, with, I give you the cam already, then you can change lah your name if you want. You can, you can actually close your LinkedIn. It's up to you, okay? I don't have any restriction on that, okay? So basically, your seniors will not lah. Some of you only, yeah. Close. Okay, write about section. Okay, uh, write about section. About section is about you, you yourself, you're talking about your passion, you're talking about your ambition, what you want to do, what is your expertise, uh, this is under about. Uh, what you are targeting, for example, uh, you want to target on becoming a future social media strategist, for example. Okay. So this about is actually like CV lah. It's very important as well because when employer come in, they will see you about uh, featured. Later on, I'm going to show you how to do it because when you do article on internship review, you can actually put this one. Okay. And then experience that I told you. Include your company name and position if you're registered with SSM. If you're not registered, you cannot put under experience. If you're not registered, you put under uh, accomplishment. This one, eh? Ready? Accomplishment. Uh, you click here and then there is project. You put under project. So as you can see, the, the, the position of accomplishment is actually quite low. Eh? Uh, that is how the, the priority be given to experience. Actually, experience is number one when it comes to resume. So for example, if the if your company have all international students, you have the uh, what we call it, you you are really serious in that business, you want to do that business for quite a long time. Uh, try to find a license, business license from your from your country. Uh, try to register under them as well uh, so that you can still put under experience. All right. <clears throat> Include your uh, under education, include your university name, put uh, IUM, or what is your bachelor? Okay. And then uh, and then you must include the skills. Okay. Include the skills. Eh? You click add new skills. Uh, click add new skills, you put entrepreneurship. You add. Okay. So once you add, uh, your your inter will be in here. Okay. So when I uh, later on at the end of the semester, I will go into your LinkedIn profile. Uh, let me see. Okay. For example, this one and accept. Um, I think some of you there is one person lah. Okay, so I go to Amira. Eh? This is my, if you know her lah. Eh? This is a new lecturer from DBA as well. Okay. And this is Dr. Amira. Okay, so she put skill endorsement. I already endorse. Did I already endorse? I already endorse. Okay. Uh, who's, who's I'm going to endorse? Okay, I don't know this guy. All right. I need Dr. Tahi. Okay, you can see some of uh, some of the uh, lecturers in here as well, um, but not everyone is is actually in here. Okay, so I put, um, I 
connection is unstable. Okay. So when I go, uh, when I want to mark your assignment, I will go to your LinkedIn and under skills endorsement, I will endorse for you. So you will get this one. Eh? Uh, this is the one who actually, for example, if I already endorse you, my name will be it here, here, meaning, meaning that employer knows that you have, you really have that skills. It's been justified by me, your lecturer. Uh, it's very good lah for you, kan? Everyone can actually put anything in their, in their resume, kan? Uh, this one is the evidence. So you put lah wherever, you put everything. Even though you're not doing financial reporting, I assume you because you are doing as a team, so you get all these skills within your, uh, within your LinkedIn. So you, uh, and also you need to connect with all your group members and connect with me as well. Uh, so that is the, the one that I... I will give 5% only on this one. Yeah. If you want to put anything, for example, you want to put projects or maybe other skills. So maybe if you love to write, uh, you can put uh, more articles. Uh, it's up to you. Lah. Okay. If you have other experience, you can put in here. For example, you are part-timer at 7-Eleven. Uh, you can put in there. It's a very valuable skill. You have license, for example, and then you go for courses like, for example, library courses, SPSS courses, APA citation courses. How you put in there? You put whatever. Uh, and then from from my class, you have Canva courses. I put in there. Okay. Uh, and then uh, language and so on. Right. Okay. So any other question before we stop our class? And my class is not it's not really that long line. And then Madam, how about the attendance? How to... Okay, then as you go to ITALIM C, okay, you go to ITALIM C, uh, you go to, let me, you go to ITALIM C, where's my ITALIM? Okay, you go to ITALIM C, you click on, and salam. Okay, because you have four sections eh, this semester. Uh, don't click on your section. Click on the general one. Eh. SEM2, yep. SEM2, MGT 4650 Entrepreneurship. I will not using your section by section uh, pages. Eh. I'm only going to use this one. I'm going to use your section by section only for online quiz later on. Uh, but for, gen uh, for attendance, you go to the, the general one is eh? SEM2 MGT4650 Entrepreneurship. Uh, this is the first one. I already put it at the uh, at number one. Okay, and the class information. You click your attendance here and then you click your present. Okay. So I think that's all. Uh, I'm gonna stop share. Okay. I think that's all. So, ah, so let me let me go to the chat. So we don't see. Ah, ada tak ada? Did you find any internet option? Some of you? Yes. Okay. Ah, maybe you, did, you go to the wrong section, lah. go to the general one, eh? Okay. Ah, uh, we should make at least three sales, right? Yes, you should make three sales. But because of, let's say, the group 21 have maybe three only, so maybe I will reduce a little bit. Uh, PT them, right? What's the GC code? There is no GC. I only use ITATLIM C. Okay. All right. Uh, where do you get uh, access? Uh, I will put the link inside the WhatsApp group. Inside the ITATLIM C, you go to my YouTube, eh? Fatin Husna Ilan. If you don't want to miss, just subscribe lah. You you have YouTube and in your mobile. Uh, so you just subscribe. Uh, what whenever come out with new video, it will come out lah. Okay. All right. Okay. Good. Uh, so thank you very much. Yeah, Alham just come in and then he knows everything. Eh? Okay. Alham, you don't have to worry. Inshallah, your group is actually having you. You will be having three. Uh, I will consult you later on. Okay. One by one. Eh? If you get lesser than six group members. Okay, so I think that's